Hey, how's it going guys? Wonafo here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to use Vega X, which is the new best executor for PC and mobile. And Vega has the highest execution power possible, so you can run any script on it. And there's also over 10,000 scripts built in for every game on Roblox. And it's the only executor where the keys last for two days, so the keys on Vega X are going to last you two times as long as they would on other exploits. And before I showcase all these cool features, I'm going to go over a quick tutorial on how to download and use Vega X. So the first step is to go to the first link in the description at vegax.gg and click on download vegax for mobile slash emulators. It's going to open up a link for ties link for you right here. And if you do have link for ties premium, you could just click this button and skip through immediately. But if you don't, you're going to have to watch like a 10 second ad. It really does not take too long. But once you have this link right here, just keep it open and go to the second link in the description, which is called Moomoo Player 12. Once you have this, just click on download. And once you're at this website, just click on download Moomoo Moo Player. And it's going to give you some sort of an installer that looks something like this when you open it for the first time. So just install it like normal, click continue a few times. So once you've installed Moomoo Moo Player, come over here to the bottom left of your computer on the Windows search bar. Type the word Moomoo. Moo, and you should see Moomoo Moo Multiplayer 12, or it could just be on your main homepage. Click on this. It's going to open up something that looks something like this. You might just see one thing here, you might see two, but just click on any blue button you see on the right side, the big blue play button. It's going to load this up for us here for a few seconds. And then once you're in this main menu, you're going to want to click on the word browser, this browser app right here, and just make a new tab if you want to. So now you have to go back into your main browser where you've downloaded all this stuff from Linkvertise, copy the Mediafire link for Vega X. Paste it into your emulator, so just right back here in this new tab, paste it in, click enter, and you should see this huge blue download button, click that, and just wait for this to load up here, it's going to take a couple seconds, and in the top left now you should see this blue downloaded symbol. All you have to do now is swipe down, so just click on this and drag down, just like you would on a phone, click on this, click install, wait for it to load, and then click open. So now it's going to open up Vega X for you, and if you ever want to go back to this, it's going to be on the home page of your emulator. And the first thing you want to do when you open up Vega X is check this box here. This allows Vega to get into Roblox so you can actually use it. Click this back arrow, and you should be completely in. So I'm just going to log in really quick and show you how this works. Now that I'm logged in, I'm just going to play a game like Blocks Fruits, for example. But after the loading screen comes up, you're going to see this Vega X key system. It's really easy to do, and you only have to do it once every two days. So you can exploit for two days completely ad free. But the first thing you want to do here is click on Get Key, go back to Chrome, and just paste this link right here in your main browser. Once you're on this site here, there might be some pop ups. You just want to close those until when you click Continue, it should bring you to a link for ties. It's actually so easy because sometimes it actually lets you skip through all the ads even if you don't have premium, but I definitely would recommend you guys get premium. Anyway, if you click get website, it's going to bring you to the next link, which by the way, that just took like, what, five seconds there. I click continue here, it's going to open up a pop-up. I'll just close that, continue again, and it's going to open up a second link for ties, which is the final checkpoint that you're going to have to do for two entire days. Click get website. It's going to say congratulations and this key is going to work for the next two days. Make sure you copy it manually. Go back into the emulator, sit into this big box here, check key. And then as you can see, in the next two seconds, we now have Vega X loaded. To open and close the menu, you can either drag this around and click on the Vega X logo. That's how you open and close it. I like to keep it up there in the top left. This is the main executor here, so you can find scripts by going to my YouTube channel, as you can see. I'm going to be posting a ton of videos within the next couple weeks on stuff like Blocks Fruits, Blade Ball, Petsim99, just showing you all the best scripts for each game. And once you have your script, you can just click on this button after you've copied it, paste and execute. It's going to say Roblox pasted from your clipboard. And there we go, we have our script. So I can just close Vega X now and use this script just like I would normally. We could just auto farm the level, really, really smooth. We could just auto farm the nearest enemies, really, really smooth. Here we go. As you can see, it's just like normal, just as if you were exploding on a PC, and then you can end this whenever you want to. But if you don't want to get scripts from my YouTube channel, you can also click on this button right here that says Script Hub. And on here, there's thousands of countless scripts you can find for every game. So if I was to look up the word Blocks Fruits, click Enter. And again, on mobile, you just click the search bar, same thing. You can see how many scripts we have for just this one game. And there's just pages and pages of scripts we can go through here, but for example, let's just pick one like Mango Hub. I'm not even sure what this is, but let's try it out. Here we go. Now we have Mango Hub. Pretty big GUI to be honest, but they do have a lot of cool stuff. 
You can also do some universal scripts, like for example, infinite yield. And let's just use any infinite yield script we can find here. There it is. So it's going to work completely fine. It says on mobile. It might not work, but it actually does. Let's try free cam. Now we have free cam. We can see around the map. And by the way, this runs so smooth on emulators. This is on maximum graphic settings. I can see way out into the distance, but I still have around 60 FPS. And if you want to know my settings for the emulator, I'd recommend you keep your performance on medium, keep Vulkan mode on, you want to have automatic tuning, all this stuff on default here. You can also change your maximum FPS, so if you want to make it even higher, you can. And I mean, there it is. That's really overpowered. You can actually use any script for any game. On the settings here, you can also change the max FPS, so I can make this like 90 if I wanted to. Uh, click enter there. Now our FPS can actually go over 60 if it was going to. And if you are on a PC using this, one of my favorite things to do is to download the dev build of VegaX. So come over here to the main VegaX website and click on download VegaX for Windows. So click on this. It's going to be like the same downloading process. It's just going to be a normal installer. And then all the instructions are going to be right here in the tutorial menu. So you can just read these if you really want to. But if you want to just watch the video, it's pretty easy. Open up VegaX. Wait for this to load. And then now all you have to do is click on inject. It's going to say this is your inject code. Copy this. Close Rob close Vega. Go back into your emulator. Paste in the inject code. Click enter. And now in your executor you can see the dev mode button is now green. And the reason it's called dev mode is because as you can see this text box in Vega X is actually way bigger than the uh, main version is. I don't know why I closed it. You actually want to keep this open from this windows version which as you can see has a lot better uh, syntax highlighting so if you are a developer you can use this and kind of code your own scripts here and if i wanted to i can also come over here to the script hub and execute one of my favorite blocks for its scripts which is zen hub as you can see it's going to be right here now loaded up into the emulator version so pretty cool feature you can do you can also do this cross platform i'm pretty sure so if you were on like another computer maybe your friend is exploiting for you or Let's say it's not working for you for some reason. You can just have your friend exploit for you from another computer. You can also change the color of the UI right here by putting in any hex value you want. So I can change it to like 0000, 000, 000, 000, 000 if I wanted it to be black. You can go to this website here if you want to find a specific color. So it's going to show you all these colors here you can choose from. Select any color and it's going to give you the code for it. And you can actually run multiple instances at the same time, so I can run two different emulators at the same time, like this one and this one, and have two different accounts auto farming at the same time. You can even use a completely different emulator, like for example, I'd recommend you use LD Player. It's a pretty good one. LD Player 9. I've been using this one a lot recently. Um, you can use any one you want. You can use BlueStacks, you can use Mimu Player, you can use Nox Emulator. And of course, you could use just an Android phone, which, by the way, I would recommend because it runs really smoothly on there. But yeah, that's pretty much all there is for this exploit. There's going to be constant updates. This is only the beginning at 4.0.2. We're going to be fixing bugs, adding more settings. You can give us feedback in our Discord server, which, by the way, is discord.gg slash VegaX, and we will add any of your suggestions. But yeah, so the link is going to be in the description for everything I showcased in this video, and I hope you guys liked it. If you did, be sure to leave a like, subscribe if you can, and as always, peace.